Hi there, I'm Michael with eTrailer.com. Today we're going to take a quick look at this Kurt T Connector Vehicle Wiring Harness with four pole flat trailer connector. This is going to provide a four way flat trailer connector at the back of your vehicle so you can power up your trailer's signal lights. Uh, that way, other motorists can tell if you're uh, stopping or turning or driving at night. Uh, make sure that you're legal and safe as you're going down the road. Uh, this system is going to be compatible with your five pole, six pole, and seven pole uh, trailer wiring systems with an adapter. Those adapters are sold separately, uh, but it will still uh, power up your trailer signal lights if you use one of those adapters. This system is custom fit for your 2023 Honda HRV. Uh, this is going to be very simple to get installed because uh, we have that custom uh, wiring connector connections, uh, so you're not going to have to worry about splicing into your vehicle's wiring. Mm -hmm. uh, you just simply unplug the wiring connections that are there, plug this in line, and that's going to recomplete that circuit so that your taillights will uh, work properly on your vehicle, but then it will also send that signal out to your trailer as well. Uh, this does have a, a trailer light converter that's going to ensure that your vehicle's wiring matches that of your trailer so that your trailer's lights will function properly. It does have a powered module that's going to connect to the battery of your vehicle to avoid overloading your vehicle's electrical system. This will provide 7.5 amps per circuit for your stop and turn lights, as well as 7.5 amps per circuit for your tail lights. Uh, to get this installed, it is going to be a pretty straightforward process. They do include instructions to walk you through every step with pictures to make sure that everything's being installed properly. Uh, but just to give you a quick overview of how it's going to work, like I said, uh, you'll unplug the connections for your uh, vehicle's taillights, plug this in line there, that will recomplete that circuit. You'll run the green wire over to your passenger side, do the same thing there. Uh, this system, your module here, is going to adhere to a solid surface. They do include some double-sided foam uh, tape here so that that will uh, be securely attached. You've got a white ground wire. They do include a self-tapping screw so that you can get that grounded uh, to a metal surface. Then we have our black wire that's going to be run up to our battery. You can see it is uh, pretty short, but they do include lots of wire uh, so that you can run that from uh, the back of your vehicle up to uh, your battery. So they've got a couple of butt connectors there to make that connection between that wire. They also have a fuse holder, so you'll uh, snip that, have one end, that will use a butt connector to connect to the other end of your wire up by your battery. And then the other end, they've got a ring terminal here so that you can put that on the positive side of uh, your battery on the positive post. And then you've got your included fuse that will go in place and allow that to uh, be protected. They also include some zip ties to uh, make sure that as you're running this wire up, uh, you can keep it in a, wherever you like it. You do want to make sure that as you're running this uh, wire up to your battery compartment and that you're going to stay away from anything that's hot or moving that could potentially damage the wire. And this is probably going to be the, the most difficult part of the whole installation. Uh, just running this wire it can be kind of time consuming, especially if you don't have your vehicle uh, lifted up on jacks, trying to run that up. It might be a little bit challenging, but definitely something that you can do. And then your four pole uh, flat trailer connector wiring here is going to be at the back of your vehicle. They do include a dust cap so that you can protect those connections from dirt and debris and that sort of thing. And then it'll be ready for you to plug it, plug in and uh, hook up to your trailer. So overall, a really simple system here for your Honda HRV. A great way to uh, add that wiring so that you can easily pull your trailer. And that completes our look for today. Again, I'm Michael with eTrailer.com. Thanks for watching.